Two SIU players you don't hear much about gave us a reason to remember their names. Xavier Johnson once again led the dogs with 18 points, though most of them came from the charity stripe. The bench making the biggest impact, led by junior A.J. Ferguson and redshirt sophomore Scotty Abube. Ferguson had eight, 15 points on the night, including eight in the first half, six of them coming off two big threes. The second half, though, belonging to Abube, the Mundelein product, scoring all 12 of his points in the final 20 minutes, and he was efficient from the field, sinking six of his seven shots. Equally impressive as the bench play, the team's defense. Southern held off a Belmont team that averaged over 80 points a game to just 63. It's why head coach Brian Mullins praised his squad's resiliency and focus after the win. We didn't let our offense affect our defense, and that's hard to do, especially against a team like Belmont. You know, we didn't shoot the ball well. I don't think it was a great offensive game um, in general, but we kept guarding. You know, a lot of times when teams don't shoot well against them, they're able to get 10-0, 15-0 runs and separate from teams, and we were able to get stops and keep the game where it needed to be until we were able to make some big baskets. That win against Belmont caps off a four-game homestand for the Salukis. Southern now shifts its focus to its next matchup, a road date with Illinois State Saturday night.